Today, I'm going to tell you four golden tips which will help to make your jalebis crispier. Listen to all the four tips very carefully because all are equally important to get crispier jalebis. Tip number one, the consistency of the batter. While mixing the batter, make sure that you add water very slowly so that you get a batter of uh, idli batter consistency and make sure that the batter is not runny. Number two, the heat of the oil. The oil should be heated once and then put or adjusted on medium flame. While dropping the jalebis, it should be uh, dropped in the medium flame and cooked for a long time so that you get a thicker outer coat, thick outer and crispier coating outside. Number three, there is one ingredient which you could add uh, along with the floor to get crispier uh, jalebis. That is, for every cup of all-purpose flour or maida, you could add about two teaspoons of rava and then mix it and allow it to allow the batter to ferment for about three to four hours before you start making the jalebis. Now, number four, uh, the sugar uh, syrup consistency. This is also very very important because if the sugar syrup is watery then also the jalebis will turn out to be very softer. The consistency you should maintain is the one thread consistency. That is when the sugar syrup boils and you take it out, uh, take it in between uh, the two index finger and the thumb finger and leave it. You should get a one thread consistency which is the appropriate one. 